All right, so now we got the Palisades Beach Invitation. Here we go. What year is this? Man, this is year 10. 10. This is year 10. To dying, baby. This yeah. is a milestone year. We're here now. It's probably your biggest <laughs> field. Would you say or it's no? The, it's the best field. It's the be best field, hands down. You got, let me run off some of these names of these programs. You got Linwood champion. in there. Winward. Champion. Taft. Awesome. Sham awesome. Chaminade, Camarillo, Palos Verde. You got Alamany in there who won state. Valencia, who's always good. Palisades is always good. Bishop Montgomery, who's always steady. Yes, they are. Westchester, City. Ch JW North, who is just always punishing people. Knocked me out of the state playoff two years ago. Crazy. Troy, who's just, you perennial. know. Perennial. They stay perennial. Stay perennial. Garces, which is on the rise, and they have a nice core group of young talent there. Definitely. D1 prospects. Santa Monica. And then you have Marlboro. And these are all like traditional schools that have great tradition. Right. Right. You know? What do you tell me a little bit about this field, man, and what was the process in in getting some of these teams to become a part of this invitational? So, um you hunt them, you watch them play, you become fans of what they do, you watch their coaches. Most of those coaches are stand up people. Um and then they're even better coaches, which is weird because you, you got these great people. And uh, you take take Ellis Barfield from Linwood for for example. Legendary. I mean, he he's a master coach. Yeah. And it's it's it, it does it get any better? Like it, it can. Right. From him. Yeah. You know, yeah. like, <laughs> it's it's it's, it's uh, you know, if I'm Dylan, if I go into my Kanye moment, he's dope. He's dope. He's dope, man. He's so dope. Going into the field, you you just want to make sure that teams are likewise, and you want them to be able to compete and put on a a unique experience. You want them to have a unique experience in the tournament. You mm -hmm. want them put on a show. You want everyone to come in and feel like they should pay more. Like they like right. they just they got they cheated you. Like this is a discount. Right. They cheated <laughs> you. Because you you're watching basketball in its purest form with master teachers. Yeah. Um you go down that list and there's some very, very, very good coaches in that group. Man, you feel like uh Coach Ellis, you got Vanessa Nightguard in there. Definitely. Brian Camacho's in there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Kelly DeMuro. Man. Uh, it's it's just a plethora of talent in one place. And it's fun to be able to host something like this. Yeah. Uh, for years, you have to go to Nike Tournament of Champions to get this. Right. Um, and we're trying to keep it in our backyard. We're saying, hey, not only will we uh, put on a, a, a good tournament with, because of the, the field, right. but when you come in here, you'll be treated right. You'll, you'll leave out and the experience will be one that you may not experience anywhere else because yeah. it's a money game. People yeah. are hosting tournaments to just get money. Yeah. Whereas I'm putting the money back into our tournament. The trophies are extravagant. Um, we're doing some some quirky things out I there. I heard the trophies are crazy. Yeah, man. You, you gotta put <laughs> I heard them, the trophies is crazy. You, you, you have to make sure that the kids are taken care of. Yeah. Like, and it's a three point contest this year also. There is a three point. I don't think is, that's ever been done. I've never a, seen that. It's an addition to our tournament. Um, I honestly stole stole it because yeah. I liked it. That's what we do. I took we coach it from it. Uh, <laughs> Kevin Kiernan at Modern Day. Okay. So I participated Shout in Shout out to event. Coach Kiernan. Saw it, loved it. He's, so doing, a, he's doing a legendary coach's clinic in August. We top 10. be trying to emulate that He'll be in the there. right way. <laughs> so that 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 thing, and but what th makes it different is he had an 18 tournament. They yeah. had a 16 team tournament. Right. And so you're going to have more contestants. And then when you get to that final, that final shootout, and that trophy comes out, you're gonna see it in those kids' eyes because these are the best of the best yeah. that are competing, and they want to win. Yeah, they're not shooting just to shoot. Yeah, you know they want to win that. And an eight foot trophy helps that. Uh, yeah, it does. <laughs> you can go home and you have to get a bigger car. Yeah, it's gonna be fun for them to to go through that process, That's and good. you get a chance to do it. You get a chance to do it in front of your teammates, your peers. And college coaches, right? Who are there looking for serviceable uh, 
scholarship athletes. Right. Like, hey. Like, and, we, and they got some in this field. You, you know, they got Jordan Canada, Chris and Simon and Winward. You, you got uh, Hannah Johnson over there, Alamany. Mm-hmm. You got you got some kids in here that, that people yeah. want to see. Yeah, definitely. I so mean, it's we, definitely some star power. Yeah, we have over 100 uh, different Division One schools attending this event wow. this year. Right. Locked confirmed. in, confirmed. Locked in, confirmed, and it's impressive because it's during their competitive season. They're playing while we're playing. Yeah. And for them to be here just speaks values of the tournament and where it's gone and its prestige, how it's improved. I'd be remiss if I didn't say uh, I wasn't grateful to like Tiffany Johnson, who helps me as my wife, and Kevin Lorick, who helps me get the field together. Mm-hmm. So when we are, um, when I say hunting, these teams down. We're just paying attention to how they're working, how they're progressing. Right. Transfers happen. Yeah. You know, yeah. Who, who got better, who got worse. Right. And then um, trying to uh, appeal to these uh, nationally ranked teams. Women's ranked number seven in the country. They are. You know, that that's impressive. They're yeah. in that field, and everyone else in that field is, is going to be gunning for them, including myself. Yeah. And um, But I love the fact that she chose... Coach Nygaard chose to bring her team here again. Yeah. And it's not, oh, I just want to jump into something. Because they could have went anywhere. Could have went anywhere. Yeah. Came back and, 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 and did business with us. And so you have, I have nothing but great things to say about the programs. The young ladies you mentioned, mentioned Kristen Simon, monster in the mid, in, in that mid post, in the low post, yeah. however you want it, she can do it. Yeah. Um, Who just yeah. committed to SC. Yeah, she did. Congratulations to her. Yeah. Jordan Canada, all-world point guard. High school basketball at its highest. And it's, it's going to be an incredible uh, venue. We, we-